Hello, YouTubers. Welcome back for another episode of my projects. Added another one to the hoard. This is a 77 CB750. Um, another project bike, and I bought it as it is. Basically, uh, guy wanted to sell it as one piece, and then he decided to part it out, and I bought it in parts, and I uh, got it for about half of what he was looking for initially, so um, show you a little bit more about what it's got going on here, and never mind the shadows, the sun, it's mid-October here in Michigan, and basically one of the cool things that this thing had, somebody had done some work on it, polished the cases, added the, uh, Finned covers on both sides. He put pod filters on it, and I've heard it run, although it didn't run great. He had uh, taken the carbs apart, and I haven't delved into that yet, but we'll see what happens. Allegedly, as an 836 kit, which remains to be determined, and it really don't matter if it just runs fine. So, um, you know, you put those semi-truck looking stacks on it which i'm not a big fan of and then wrap the uh, exhaust whatever um the rims on it and i put those on they i had bought quite a while back those are off of uh cb 750 automatic aluminum rims so i really kind of like the look of those and they're supposed to be a little lighter the seat came with it probably one of those amazon specials it is uh, as hard as it looks. Very, very hard. The tank's actually in really nice shape, and it was painted, and he started sanding all that down. I have the side covers as well. I have a rear fender, but it's butchered. The front, he butchered and threw it out. Put these cool flat track bars on there, which I like those. Pretty cool levers, and he put some aftermarket switches on. And these can't see anything behind your mirrors um, I saw pictures of the bike originally it looked pretty nice I also got a better fairing with it which I will use on another one that we're doing I'll show you that bike in another video the other 77 CB 750 that we bought about six or seven years ago I'm finally starting to work on that bad boy you see the cool fin covers I just love those things they're die cast and chrome plated. Um, not mint, but they look the part. Um, the other cool thing that came with these uh, aluminum rims when I bought them was a drilled rotor, which uh, I don't know if somebody did that themselves or if at one time there was an aftermarket piece available. You can see there that it's a DID aluminum rim. I'll probably, who knows? This bike is uh, questionable as to what we're going to do with it down the road. You can see it's a 77. Let's see, rattle can the frame. I got a bunch of other parts with it, too. That, uh, And then the hoop, of course. They put the hoop on there without even thinking about tire clearance. So um, that would obviously come off. And I still have the factory rear piece, so I could fix that for sure. But you can see it was... Uh, I think this had 12,000 original miles on it. And the pictures I saw, it was a good looking motorcycle. Um, we'll see what happens, but the tank is really nice shape. Just, uh, you know, one of them things. Aftermarket master cylinder, all billet handles and stuff, which is pretty neat. The switches look pretty neat as well for, uh, inexpensive stuff and a straight pull throttle can't start it because when he was parting it out he sold the coils and the whole ignition system off it but i have heard it run it didn't smoke it sounded good so but uh that's it sorry for the shakiness here but uh first time using this camera but uh that's it 77 cb 750 We'll see what happens to that in the future. Please like and subscribe if uh, you're interested in seeing more updates. 
I'll have other projects coming again soon. Thanks for watching.